Hi, I'm Nicole Kidman, and I am reading to the lighthouse. In a moment, he would ask her, are we going to the lighthouse? And she would have to say, no, not tomorrow. Your father says not. I fell in love, and I experienced an enormous amount of yearning and desire and emotions through reading books. I remember being a child and reading War and Peace when I was really young, like 13 or 14, and just being completely swept away by the characters. And, be, and it was during my summer holidays because I wasn't allowed to go to the beach because I have really fair skin. And so that was how I was in a room during most of the day reading War and Peace. Fantastic. <laughs> it led me to being an actor. Had there been an axe handy or a poker, any weapon that would have gashed a hole in his father's breast and killed him there and then, James would have seized it. Such were the extremes of emotion that Mr. Ramsay excited in his children's breasts by his mere presence. I suppose I felt connected to, to Virginia and her work because I'd played her, because I'd had to conjure things of um, finding the, the, the words, finding the ideas, and her ability to um, delve into the most profound, deep subject matter, but with accessibility, is beautiful, and, it, and that's what draws me to her. He was incapable of untruth, never tampered with a fact, never altered a disagreeable word to suit that pleasure or convenience of any mortal being, least of all of his own children, who sprung from his loins, should be aware from childhood that life is difficult. I was excited to go to work every day because I was going to work and reading, these, reading this extraordinary um, novel. And it was my work, but it was, it was um, pleasure. If you love books, then what a great way to spend a few days, right? I mean, it's that simple, and I love books. Here Mr. Ramsey would straighten his back and narrow his little blue eyes upon the horizon, one that needs, above all, courage, truth, and the power to endure. How many of us say, gosh, I just, I don't have time to read, but we're all driving, and we're all still, I mean, I, I run, so I have, you know, 45 minutes where I can listen to something. And instead of watching the TV, you can, or listening to music when you work out, you can listen to something. You can listen to one of the great novels you always wanted to read.